Dear student, due to coronavirus, school started online classes for your study. So you can subscribe Golden Flower Palia YouTube channel, like and press the bell icon. Hello, good morning, students. Myself is Kishwaha, Hindi teacher. And today, I'll explain. the chapter 1 reproduction in organism and the main part is events of sexual reproduction earlier you know very well about sexual reproduction sexual reproduction meet two parents gamete formation and their fusion of gametes so this kind of reproduction shows variation that occurred in offspring or progenies now let us this events of sexual reproduction are bifurcated in three part first one is pre fertilization events further divided in two part one is gamete genesis and second is transfer of gametes so this gamete genesis means develop made of gametes and it will be two type one is spermatogenesis is spermatogenesis and second is oogenesis now in transfer of gametes gamete transfer from now transfer of gametes after gametogenesis it is essential to gametes fuse or physically so they form gametes now in lower plants gametes are motile with the male or female what in higher plants male gamete motile what female gamete is static or not in movement so in plants gametes transfer with the help of pollination and mean lower algae or bryophytes with the help of what after the transfer of gamete fertilization occurs and this fertilization also known as syngamy so it is a fusion of male and female gamete to form diploid zygote no fertilization for the divide in two part one is the external fertilization and another is internal fertilization in external fertilization gametes externally meet together outside of the medium and in internal fertilization gametes fertilize inside the body so uh, for external example 
from and for internal example human wing now last part is fertilization this is a post fertilization event and in this section two events are occur one is zygote formation and another is embryo formation embryo formation now students about gametophysis formation of haploid gametes from diploid meiosis with the help of meiosis or reduction division means gametes are haploid in nature means having half number of chromosomes and meiosite gamete producing cell this is a diploid in nature now this gametogenesis having three aspect one is isogamy means here gametes are similar in appearance and both are the motile in nature for example a green alga clematomonas now in an isogamy an isogamy means both the gametes have a different shape and size word having mobility or motility means male gamete and female gamete motile in nature now third one about oogamy oogamy having non motile female gamete and motile male gamete both structures are dissimilar in nature and this kind of phenomena occurred in humans or no students about fertilization uh, this process is also known as cell gamete in which male gamete fuses with female gamete to form zygote now this fertilization divides into part one is external fertilization and second is internal fertilization what will happen in external fertilization means when fertilization occurred outside of the female body this is known as external fertilization in external fertilization the number of male gametes and female gametes more because medium like water sometimes have dangerous for the gametes also for example frog and fish and cousins formed by external fertilization more vulnerable to predators so they are risky now in internal fertilization when fertilization occurred inside the female body so in internal fertilization the number of male gametes is more and the number of female gamete is less for example human or you can say a mammals and birds also they have protection inside the female body so they are less vulnerable to predators so it is about internal fertilization and external fertilization 
Now in post fertilization elements, uh, this is the last part of the sexual reproduction. So in post fertilization elements, uh, here zygote formation and second is formation of embryo or embryogenesis. So what will happen in zygote formation? Development of diploid zygote having chromosome number 2x from haploid gametes is known as zygote formation. Now about embryogenesis, development of embryo from diploid zygote is known as embryogenesis. So what will happen in this event? Now gametes physically contact together. So this is a fusion of gamete. After fusion of gametes, zygote form. When zygote is formed, it divides mitotically to increase the number of cell and cell differentiation. So two cell zygote, four cell zygote and a multicellular embryo is formed. So now this multi cell embryo further divides and redivides to create a whole organism. Now class, there are two kinds of animals. One is the oviparous, do lay eggs. And one is the viviparous, do give birth of young ones. In later phases, oviparous lay eggs in enormous in number. Sometimes some predators eat the egg, so they have this in nature. Now viviparous, they will be safe inside the female body, so they are less risky. That is the clear things. Do self-study at home and stay home, save lives. Thank you very much.